what's up welcome back for some more animal crossing today we are making an ice cream stand i kind of just wanted to chill around my island and get used to being back i just got back from vacation but we found something that was in my store that kind of inspired me to make some ice cream stands today and this is the last stand that we're going to be making in our farmer's market it's the only space that we have left i really 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 like how this one turned out i hope you guys enjoy this video if you like this video hit that like button let me know if you want to see more videos like this and if you're new here hit that subscribe button because i do post every single day and that's for me i will see you in the video hello there everyone right now on pepper it is 4 17 p.m on tuesday july 14th 2020 welcome back to an actual video made on the same day um i just got back from my vacation it was very nice very nice but i'm glad to be back it feels a little bit weird to be back no news dang i've been gone for a couple of days and there's still no news today i don't really even know what i want to do today i was kind of thinking about it and I think I may just want to like do some construction and stuff. Just like settle back into it and like get used to my new island. Because I'm still not really used to it to be honest. Oh, check out that shirt and that hat. Wow, I'm going to cop some things later today. Of course, we are doing our designer of the day. We haven't done one in probably almost a week now. Just because I had um, done a bunch like at 1230 in the morning. So I'm really excited. I was looking up uh, the entire time I was away any new designers that are available. And there are some really cute like summery clothes that I found. So um, we're going to look up those today. Honestly, I tend I find that I tend to go for like more themed stuff. But today I just kind of wanted to do something that, you know, is more casual, more casual wear. Ooh, OK, so they have like a couple of other designs you can put around your house. They have oh, they have like a clock. I think they're probably in the process of making that or something. It doesn't look quite complete, but that's really cool. Oh, that's really neato. They have like a stitched sweater. That is actually cool. Um, the thing that actually drew me towards this person actually is this picture that I saw on Instagram. I think this is like a lavender shirt dress. I honestly can't tell. It just looks like lavender to me and I really like it. So, oh, but they also have a cute Marshall sweater. Ooh, they nice flower dress. That'd be nice. Um, I don't know how to say their name, but this is their creator code. If you want to check them out, I highly recommend it. I think their stuff is really cute and simplistic, which is kind of hard to find. Um, I think that I would also have this issue as a designer that I would kind of overcomplicate things, but I really like the designs of these. These are like things that I would actually wear in real life. So yeah, if you're down with this kind of style, I definitely recommend checking them out. They have cute little tails with these sweaters. It's so cute. So cute. I love my little character. Although I think I am going to change her hair. See, this is what I mean. I think the Able Sisters should have like a hairdresser or something like right next to them. Instead, I have my little uh, Able Sisters uh, store extension that I made myself. Uh, so let's see. I'm going to change up my hairstyle. Um, this is really difficult. I really do wish they made it uh, an extension of like their hair types. Like it's all... At the very most, this is the most wavy one they got. This is the most they have that's similar to curly. And it's like barely 2B wavy. Maybe 2C, like at the most. I also saw some people suggest that maybe we could do like heterochromia with the eyes. Like make, make one eye color different than the other. Just because it would be more representational. Um, but I do understand this is a very simple game. So we'll see what they come out with in the future. I think the pigtails are super cute today. I don't know why I'm really feeling it. So yeah, I think today really what I'm just going to do is just kind of like run some errands, clean up my island, just kind of get used to my regular days. I haven't been here in probably a week. Uh, low key forget how to play the game a little bit. <laughs> no, I'm joking. It's not that difficult, but like still it's... <gasps> what is that? Is that an ice cream? Yo, I want to make an ice cream stand immediately. Wow, okay, never mind. That's exactly what we're going to be making today. Um, I don't have any ice cream stalls, though. So we're just going to have to kind of like wing it and do whatever. Uh, let me see. I do need wood for the actual stall. This is honestly the worst part of making stalls, so that it takes 12 regular wood. And that wood is so hard to come by. And also my axe just broke, like... It's literally so hard. Wait, do I have another one? Oh, man. Okay, you gotta do it right there. Ten more to go. <laughs> it costs like 12 wood just to make one. 
And there goes my flimsy axe. So yeah, I'm gonna have to build another one. I forget how, what it takes. I think it's twigs and stone for the for the flimsy axe. So, oh, what's this? A paw print door plate? <gasps> oh my God. I need to make like custom door plates for like all of my characters or something. Maybe that's what I'll do for my next couple videos is like make their little like garden areas in front of their house and like have them like super customizable like that. I seen a couple ones online that I really like. So I'm gonna try to do that. Okay, so yeah, I need tree branches like forever. Oh my God, are you joking? No, just like end me. No, you're joking. You're joking. Go to someone's house. Go to someone's house. Sucker, no. <laughs> that was actually tragic. Look at me. Oh. Okay, well, at least I can create some medicine like right away. I don't know why I just didn't take the wasps. No, and I, I literally saw Zucker too. You know what? That's on me. That's on me. Okay, well, at least we know we won't see any more. And I have three weeds, so that's perfect. All right, now we're just gonna be shaking, shaking this tree for some weeds. Oh no, it's a money, it's a money rock. Oh well, it looks create a flimsy axe and also some medicine. Oh, I need to use the wood to create the axe. Are you joking? My God, this is gonna take me forever. All right, we're gonna use our stone axe. Hopefully this is the only one that we need. Probably not because wood, like I said before, is extremely hard to come by. We're just going until this axe gives out, which is probably gonna be any second now. I need Uno, Uno, more wood. And oh my God, that was right. That was it right there. That was like so lucky. Yeah, regular wood is like the hardest thing to come by. Like iron nuggets are easier. I wonder if I've caught that guy before. I don't know. I'm gonna try to find out. Na, 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 na. Don't mind me. I'm just not even doing anything. Let's see. I caught a brown cicada. Is that new? I think that might be new. New for me, at least. Let's craft the uncraftable. A stall. Now, here's my issue again, is that I know there is, I think there's like a tiny ice cream that you can make. I don't know if I have that. But I'd be super happy to find out. So I want to use my customization kits to try to make something that kind of looks like it would be an ice cream stand. Uh, let's customize. Let's customize. I can only customize this all. Nice. Dark brown as always, you know me. I'm gonna look at Sable's patterns. I feel like that's a really cool way to get like all of your patterns, like have a lot of patterns on your island. I find that I do focus a lot of mine on the stalls, which I probably does take away a little bit from, you know, what I can do because it takes up so much space. Um, I think the rainbow one would look really cool if we use that. Um, and we already have this one for our juice bar. This one looks really cool. I'm not going to lie to you. Although there is like such thing as like a modern ice cream store, but I don't know if I want that because the ice cream that I did buy is like super rainbowy. So I'm thinking that we might use this striped pattern. That's definitely a contender. Um, um the other striped ones just kind of seem like they would be on like my bed sheets. So we'll see how that works. Um, these ones honestly are kind of cute, but nothing like really screams with that rainbow stuff. This one's cute. We could definitely go for the checkered, the checkered one right here. I'll definitely think about that. Um, traditional, not so much. It's more muted, darker colors. I want something that's very vibrant. So definitely, definitely none of these. Uh, the retro ones look really nice. Like these ones right here. I like those. And yeah, the great thing about these is that they don't take up any space in like what you already have on your island. So you can definitely use these to your advantage. Ooh, I like the natural. Like I like the roses there. I don't know why though. I'm just, I'm still thinking about the, the striped one. Yeah, I think we're going to go with the striped one. It's just, there's, it's not able to be contested. It's just so good. All right, we're gonna customize it. And you know what? Even if I don't like it, no harm done. I can just customize it later. It only takes three customization kits. Oh my gosh. I can't believe I found the lamp. Or that it just happened to be in my store. Like what luck is that? Place this item. Ooh, looks so good. And then also our new lamp. 
Okay, no, that looks so good. <gasps> that looks so good. Wow, that looks so cute. I kind of like it next to the plants. Kind of gives it a vibe. All right, so I got to go home and find a couple of things that would work well with the ice cream. Good thing that my house now is like super close. So it doesn't take me nearly as long to actually do this. I probably will put away a couple of things just because I don't have a lot of room in my bag as is. Also, sad note, if you guys didn't realize there is like a limit to how much things you can, how many things you can put in your storage. So you are eventually going to have to just like sell stuff. I think I'm probably getting pretty close to like what my limit is right now. So that's unfortunate, but I will keep using it until I have to do a mass selling of my storage. Let's look and see what we have for ice cream. Obviously I can't put, you know, big housewares stuff on it. So I'm gonna have to look at miscellaneous. Um, I think that even though I use this for the juice bar, the mixer would look really cool. And also the, probably the analog kitchen scale too, just because like, you know, you gotta weigh the ice cream or whatever. I don't know, I'm, th I'm thinking outside the box here. Ooh, the stand mixer would look nice. Either the stand mixer or the blender. Like you can't have both, you know what I'm saying? It's gotta be like a kitchen thing. And then like a food thing. I don't really have a lot for food. Do I have any bowls? I wonder, or like cups? Like I could use that as like, it could be just like a cone. <gasps> oh, what if I did ice cream cake? Oh, that's really cool. I could just do ice cream cake. Oh yeah, I kind of have like this diner apron that I could put. I'm gonna move that to my pockets. Maybe I'll put it behind. Okay, yeah, no, that's good for now. Let's see how that looks. <gasps> oh, ice cream cake maker. I kind of like that idea. That's kind of cute. Ooh. All right, so first thing, of course, I want to have, uh, I'll put the stand mixer here. I feel like that would look better if I had the cake over here just because that's facing inward. So we're gonna check out that wedding cake. Wow. I mean, you can't really see it, but like you can tell it's a cake. That's nice. And then I, gr I grabbed the diner apron just cause I wanted to see what it would look like if I placed the apron here, place the item. Wait, there's no room. There should be. Let me go a little further out, maybe. Cause then I was thinking, oh, why am I doing that? I was thinking, what if I had outfits to match each like stand? Or is it not even gonna go far enough in? Does that work? That kind of works. Okay, what if I pushed it over one a little bit so you can see it better? Does that work even better? Oh my God, that works even better. Look at that. It looks like I'm talking to someone because you can't really see their head this way, right? Oh my God, what if I had that one for like every single thing? And then I could just like put on the outfit if I ever wanted to like go to one. Wow, I like it. This is really cute. I wish I had a little popsicle or something. It would make me look like I'm at the store or something. Wow, you know what? That was a really good video to like just jump right back into it. And I think that we finished our farmer's market like officially. Like that would be the last store because that was the last space I had. Yeah, it is. Wow, that's really cool. So yeah, we officially finished our farmer's market. That's a good way to jump back into making some videos. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video. I really did. It was like kind of fate. Like this was in my store of all days. I've never really had anything cool in my store. So that's cool. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for me today. And I will see you in the next one. Bye.